Selective attention strategies in film and design, motion graphics, and audio logos are the three most important concepts that resonated most during my journey through the organizational structures class. Hi, my name is Mike Logan and welcome to my course reflection. Harry Mills wrote in his book, Artful Persuasion, that the inherent difficulty of selective attention is when editors overwhelm the audience by flooding them with tidal waves of information. In this design challenge, notice how I move the globe from the left corner to the right, ensuring that it doesn't interfere with the text animation, but also ensuring it guides the viewer to the next image, completing the design. Selective attention is a collapse in cognitive mental focus due to the distraction of outer interference. Ruth Clark in Building Expertise says that viewers will see more if you aim your flashlight at a specific object than if you try to split the beam among multiple objects. Understanding selective attention techniques guided the viewer in the direction that I wanted. However, motion graphics added to its success. Motion graphics takes the static and transforms it into dynamic. John Krasner stated in Motion Graphic Design that motion graphics are vital to our complex contemporary visual landscape. It brings life to design through motion, creating a more impactful effect on target audiences and viewers. Motion graphics can create needed separation and differentiation between a brand and its competitors that sell or advertise similar products or services. Using week three's design challenge as an example, notice that the earth graphic spans across the entire landscape with a powerful motion graphic at the end expanding the globe, placing the final touches on the message of awareness to Earth Day. Bill Byrne 3D Motion Graphics wrote that client demands force designers to push the envelope and develop their motion graphic skill set in two and three dimensional methods or fall victim to the market, which will find some one or services that can meet their expectations. Mark Spencer explains in his book Motion 4 that text, audio, and video make up the language of motion graphics. With these elements implemented, a decent motion graphic is born. A combination of visual and audio is used to enforce branding recognition. George Buka noted that logos are identifiers of brands that conceptually, stylistically, or metaphorically reflect the brand's personality in the book Principles of Logo Design. The the audio logo is a brief melody or sound sequence. Adding an audio logo to the Earth Day graphic strives to connect our viewers and listeners to both land and sea by implementing the wind and ocean sounds with a lovely sound of a morning dove. Adding selective attention techniques in shorts, static designs, and motion graphics allows my audience to be led and focused to the service and benefits my business offers. Finally, an audio logo is vital to sonic branding and sound identity. I will record multiple sound bites from the work done on automotive dent removal and create an audio logo. I will apply these three concepts in my professional career to differentiate my brand and business from the competition. Thank you for your time.